Tell me to come home. Answer the question. Please go. What, you're taking a holiday, vacation? After six months of marriage, am I really that hard to be with? Michael, spit it out, you're scaring me. As someone. I'm sorry, I, I left a note. I've just been feeling empty. I didn't want to let you down or our families down. Everything just seemed too perfect. Something wasn't right and it hasn't been for a while. And I'm, I'm a coward. You're lying. No, no, I just... I, I know just... you better than you know yourself. Tell me what's going on. Not in this lifetime or any other. What's going on? I don't love you anymore. Liar. I know you better than you know yourself from the inside out. Now take a breath. And tell me what's going on. I'm ill. Very ill. Cancer testicular. Quite common for a young man, apparently. Never in my darkest moments did I think that as soon as I found my peace, my true love, would the disease take it away from me. I see two very distinct periods in my life. Before and after I met you. One was dark and one was light. And I refuse to drag you into the coming darkness, so please let me go. You, um, uh, you never were a good packer. I never told you this, but on our, our honeymoon, I completely repacked your case. Mary, please, Not only were the dirty and clean clothes in there, but I mean, they were totally wrong for the climate. What would you do without me? Did you hear me? Did you hear me? I have cancer. You don't have it. It's happening to you, but it isn't you. And for the record, it's happening to us. Because I'm going nowhere. We're young. We're young. Your future should not include this. It should include puppies and having an adventures. Arguing about ridiculous things and having makeup sex. Lying in bed and taking in each other's breath all night long. Not doctor's needles puking, helping me to the toilet and watching me slowly die. Stop. Stop right there. You're going to live. Do you hear me? There's not a single fiber in my body that doesn't believe that. I will not put you through this. I love you too much. So if you cared about me one bit, you would go. And if you cared about me at all, you should let me be here. I would build a solid foundation with my bare hands if that's what it takes to get you better. Blood, sweat, tears, whatever it takes. Because love isn't about marriage and honeymoons and fawning over each other. Sometimes it's shit and dark and hard. But together we can get through anything. The doctor said it was stage two. That means I don't that... care about the facts. All I know is 
in this moment, I love you. I have loved you for a thousand lifetimes. And I'm not gonna lose you in this one. I love you. Maybe I can show you how to fold. <laughs>